Hey YouTube family and friends, welcome back to my channel. Just being me, Devonise. So happy Sunday, y'all. Um, look, we actually going into Monday uh, morning now, but yeah, still happy Sunday. Um, yeah, so I hope everybody had a blessed day today. Feeling blessed, feeling good, you know, and that your day was very bright today. Mine was. Um, so in today's video, I will be sharing with you my new backsplash. Now, I done talked about this backsplash for quite some time, so I finally uh, got it done. I just got like a little section that um, I'm waiting on my other tiles to come so I can finish it. But for the most part, it's done. It's complete, you know, um, once I get those other pieces, they'll be completed. But I I'm fine to share with you what I've already done. It's a DIY pro project that I've done myself. And yes, I am so proud of myself, um, you know. Uh, when I originally got those tiles, the mirror tiles, I had planned on doing them myself. And then I kind of got a little chicken. Um, and then I said, I'll just pay somebody to do it. And then time went on by and I just, they were sitting out in my garage and everything. And so when we were cleaning out the garage, it's like, bring the boxes in the house. You know, <laughs> you know, I'm going, I'm going to start on this. I'm going to start on this. And so when I started on it, you know, the first day. And um, once I got it set up and everything, um, I knew right then that I, it was going to be a hard project <laughs> because, um, you know, just brick layering for one. I had never used a glass cutter. I did purchase one of those also from Amazon. But, yeah, after breaking quite a few glasses, I got the hang of it. And so, like I said, I love the ending result. Can't wait to share it with you. Um, what else was I going to tell you about that? Um the backsplash. Oh, I started on the backsplash last Sunday night. And, um, yeah, I got, when I say I got like a little small section completed, I'm talking about when I say completed, I probably had six tiles down. I'm telling you, I was just so, um, kind of burned out just from that, you know, and, um, just trying to figure it out. And so when that Monday came, um, you know, I did a little bit that morning and I just kind of like, okay, whatever, I'll do it. But that Monday night came and so I said, okay, um, I had kind of got yeah, a little bit past the, the, the faucet done, the sink. And I said, okay, I'm not going to bed until I just at least get this one side completed. So I got that side completed and I decided to start on the other side and I just kept going. It's like I got an energy boost. And, um, yeah, so like I said, very, very satisfied. And I hope that you all will, um, you know, enjoy it, this video. And I know, and I'm not bragging, but I think that you all will <laughs> like my backsplash also. I hope it inspires someone to, to buy it, the backsplash, the one I have, the mirror black backsplash, or either just a backsplash that you like in general. And then, you know, do it yourself. If I can do it, you can do it. So, yeah, um... What else was I going to talk to you about? Um, oh, so, okay. So when I recorded doing the tiles, I didn't record myself actually doing the whole project. I, I recorded myself starting off and that was by putting a muscle bound, the sticky um, two-sided tape on the, on the, on top of the tile that I already had. I cleaned that and um, one side I had to degrease over by the stove and everything. But once I laid that out and, you know, where I wanted to do it, uh, where I was going to get started at anyways, um, I recorded that with my new camcorder and my footage is froze. It's like I cannot open it up. I cannot do anything with it. I'm a little ticked off at it. So I'm going to try again, you know, to, to see if it'll let me open it up. But if not, I'll just show you what I have and just show you the ending result. I'm sorry about that, but I really wanted you to see the muscle bound, you know, that I, how I laid that down and then how I actually got started. And so, yeah. So, yeah, that was it. I just wanted to share that with you. And so, yeah, let's get on with this video. If you are new to this channel and you like what you see at the end of this video, please hit that subscribe button. We'd love to have you join the family and to my existing subscribers, my family. Please like and share. And as always, I thank you all for all of your love and support. Thanks. Hey, YouTube family. Welcome back. Okay, so happy Monday, y'all. Today is Monday, February 27th. 
And so right now, I just want to share um, a haul with you, grocery haul, and um, some um, cleaning products. So let me turn this camera around and get started. Hey YouTube family and friends, welcome back to my channel, Just Being Me, Devonese. So y'all, I just got a quick haul today, and by the way, happy Friday y'all, it's the end of the week, I know some of y'all are very happy about that. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna jump right on in. Um, so, in my room, I was telling y'all about the, uh, that tea wall that I have, and I've had it the wall has been painted like that for maybe about 12 years and so yeah I, I still love that color but I'm tired of it because you know I've been trying to tone things down and um y'all already know with the teal chairs and everything I had in my dining area teal all throughout the living room which I still will bring teal in because I love that color I just didn't want I want it to be like um an accent and me throwing some a pillow or a rug or something in there just temporarily yeah, so now, like I said, with the wall in my room, I'm, I'm, I'm going to re be getting or be painting my bedroom a lighter color. I think I'm going to go with this light gray. I can't think of the name of it um, by Barra Paint that I put throughout the upstairs when I changed it from the, I had like the um, taupe color with the white trim and white doors, everything. So I, I went down to the light gray and with, you know, still the white trim. I'm thinking I may take this same color in my room or either just go just a tad bit darker, just a little bit darker, but still on the lighter side. And but the wall, the accent wall, back to that. I didn't know if I wanted to do just um just do it the same color as everything else, or if I wanted to keep it as an accent. So I've been going back and forth with this bold color with black. Now I done done black walls before. Well, I got it in my house now in my family area, but I had a black wall before in my living room at my other house and um, I loved it. You know, I love that accent wall, but in my bedroom, uh, I was thinking to do that. And the reason why is because I saw this wallpaper, this wallpaper that I was going to purchase from Amazon kind of looked like crocodile skin. And I really like that um, the wallpaper. So I was I can't remember the price. I want to say it was like either $34 or $34 or $43, something like that. Per roll. I can't remember the size of it. <laughs> but um anyways, I was gonna order um I was gonna start off with one roll because I was gonna get the larger uh size first. And then I ran across uh this. So I decided that what I was gonna do is just paint the wall black. And then for my second coat, I will put the crocodile print on myself. So I ordered this um, uh, from Amazon, this paint roller. And I think, um, there's no receipt in here. I can't remember the exact price. I I'll link it in the description box, but let me go to my Amazon real quick. I think that, because um, that just came today. Um, let me see how much I spent on that. Um, it was it was nineteen dollars. So if you're interested in that, we'll see how my wall turns out, and then you know you can decide. But I I had I thought about doing like a champagne color on the wall and then doing the champagne uh you know crocodile look on top of it. But we'll see. We'll see and cuz in the next few days it'll be done. I um I got some new furniture that I want to share with you. It's not I'm not unboxing that today. But um I'll share that with you pretty soon. Um Also I ordered this uh this stopper sink stopper <laughs> from Amazon the gold and black so it matches the sink yeah so 
I need to get me some black ones, the ones that you just sit in your sink. I usually will have like the teal color ones just sitting down in there. So I need some more, some black ones just to sit in the sink um, to cover up the silver rim. But yeah, um, got the gold and black. And once again, I'll go back to my Amazon and um, let you know how much I spent on it. That. Mm -hmm. It was. Y'all like she ain't even got her stuff together and she recording already. She should have waited. Let me see. It was. Mm -mm -mm. Ten ninety nine. So ten ninety nine for this. And like I said, very pretty. Just matches the sink and you know the gold in the kitchen. So next I purchased and let me pull that up. Next I purchased this um pillowcase. And this pillowcase is is a size 18 by 18 and I hope it looks like with the pitch a little like oh feels kind of velvety I didn't even know that I should have read a little bit more so this is the pillowcase right here yeah it's velvety and it's thick too, y'all. And so here's the back. And then it has like the piping going around it. Here's the zipper. But yeah, the back the back is all black. And then the front of it is um uh you know the zipper print. And this was $19.99 right here. So I hope I had that right. I think it was $19.99. $17.99. Sorry. And like I said, it's a size 18 by 18. So I'm going to just take one of my pillow inserts and stuff it inside. Or I'll put the whole pillow in there. It don't matter. It's the same thing. Um, and then this is the last thing that I ordered. Like I said, I do have new furniture um, to share with you. I don't know if it'll be in this video or not. You know, but um, what I purchased is for my bedroom. Um, but I can move it throughout my house if I decide to do that. So, but yeah. All right. Let me get this price. Okay, so this is an um trying to see the price, that's all. Okay. So this thing here was $19.99. And everything is from Amazon. And so this is which I showed you in a haul not long ago uh, uh, over the sink uh, dish rack you know and they also have pictures where you can kind of if you want to wash off your food or your fr fruit and stuff you can lay it on top of there and rinse it off and stuff if you want to season your meat you can lay it on there but you know I just use mine for dishes because I have the gray and stainless steel one and so I ordered the black one I'm gonna see what the black one looks like. The gray does match because my cabinets are black are gray. It just had the stainless steel uh, little pipes going through. And so, uh, one second. Okay, y'all. So within that little bit of time, whew, me coming right back. Oh, you see all of this stuff sitting around. So as I was saying, I bought one of these uh, over the sink dish uh, racks. 
And so I bought this one in all black. I didn't see all black at first. But so I, when I bought the drain, I was like, let me look for um, a black and gold one. And when I looked for the black and gold one, it was kind of pricey. So I was just like, you know, it's not that serious for me to pay to do that. But I said, I'll try the black one since my sink is black and see how it is. If, if I don't really care for the look, I just keep the gray one on there and then an order, go ahead and order the uh, black and uh, gold one. So, yeah. All right. Um. I'm in between doing things, so that's why I'm out of breath. Okay, so let's go over to my sink. Okay, so here's the, the one that I have right here. And so I'm going to roll this one up. And I'm going to lay this black one out and see what it's looking like. Okay, so here's the, the one that I have right here. And so I'm gonna roll this one up and I'm gonna lay this black one out and see what it's looking like. It's heavier too. This black one got some weight to it. Um, so let me see uh, how this one is. Pretty much the same. I guess the black do look better, kind of blend in better with the sink. So yeah, I think I'll keep the black one up, but I'm not gonna get rid of this gray one over here and so y'all once again let me share y'all i put some things back on the counter kind of rearranged but i just wanted to she let you see um my uh, backsplash again i'm so mad that my footage um i recorded with my new camcorder and my footage for me starting to lay down the muscle bound before i started the tiles and everything it's like it's froze it won't let me open it up and i don't know what's over here by the stove I don't have no light let me turn that on but yeah I still I haven't finished that I'm waiting on my box to come in so I can finish this side over here um yeah. so I got that covered up so that it, it'll stay sticky but I changed the format over here as I was saying um I was tired and it just was easier to do it this way it is no big deal to me I didn't brick layer on this side over here by the stove because it was already hard enough to do it you know, try to ease some in back of the stove and everything. And, um, yeah, so. Yeah, I got those on. But it looks neat. That's what matter. And I'll get this other part finished up and everything. And, um, yeah. Share that with you once I'm done with that. Okay. Okay, y'all, so don't mind the mess. Okay. So I got some Dawn dish detergent. I went to get me some perfect glass. Got loaded back up on the Clorox white. Got some paper plates. Some barely theirs. I said barely theirs, barely there. <laughs> I got um, some Airwick um, refills. I got some clean shower from Walmart. I got some Lysol, brand new day. That smells so good. Ooh. I got some Clorox cleaner. Got some Febreze. This Sweet Penny. That's my Sweet Peony. That's my first time buying this thing. It smells pretty good, too. And so from Sam's, I got some on the border queso chips. And then. Walmart, you know, I got me another Burners. Um, I got some chili beans. Oh, my bag's on the floor, y'all, so that's where I'm at. Bent down on this floor. Got some black beans. I got some um, bread from Walmart. Just some little Italian bread. I got some sour cream. Cheese. I think I got three bags of cheese. I got some shredded lettuce. Tomato. Mm -hmm. More cheese. I got some chicken tenderloins. I'm making chicken tacos. Um, probably tomorrow. I got some Tina's burritos. Got some 
chips with the um, the Walmart brand. Hannah Lime, these are really good right here. I got some eggs. And from Sam's, I got a rotisserie chicken. I got the double pack of Caesar salad. Some flour tortillas. I got some shrimp, raw shrimp. I got this lobster bisque. I hope that is good. I got some turkey. That's a double pack. And I got some ground beef and some water. And then I got some ramen noodles and some sushi. The uh, spicy California roll. And so yeah, that's it, y'all. So I also purchased the 40 count uh, pack of the Members Mark Purified Water. Okay, so I also bought some palm toilet paper, the 45 rolls from um, Sam's. And I picked up me some more. Uh, let me see with this lighting. Some more of the half size um, aluminum pans. Okay, so yeah, that's it.